So here guys, today we have a census 2019 tablet. This is Propo census tablet. I was looking for this tablet on YouTube for the last few months and I didn't get a proper uh, review video. So I wanted to buy this product. I bought this product a few days back and I bought it like around 60 dollars, 60 US dollars and I just kept a plain card to compare the size of this product, size of this tablet. Uh, so let's just start with the unboxing. I want to tell you that I have already used the tablet for like a day uh, because I wanted to give you a better review for this product. And I went to charging the tablet and it came full charge. It came with full charge. So I didn't have to charge the tablet when I checked it. So let's just start with the tablet. So as you can see, we have a screen protector, but this screen protector didn't came with this. As you can see, we have a bad part over here in here. I, I hope you can see in the video. So we have a bad part over here in there. I use a Galaxy Samsung Tab 3 screen protector over, over this one uh, so because I wanted to have a smooth, smooth touch. Finish. So let's just start. I already did the setup, basic setup. I have already went to starting with a few apps. I went through installing a few apps like I've installed Perfect Piano, Group Pad, uh, Art of War, Battery apps, few Battery apps, Battery Monitoring apps, and Network apps. I uh, just wanted to download some songs and I went to Play Store to install this app, a music call it. I highly recommend you guys because this app has no ads. So as you can see. So the tablet itself is uh, quite bright. I'm in a dark room with a uh, good lightning so we can, we can decrease the brightness so that I can take a proper video of this one. So it looks good now, right? Maybe, maybe I should decrease full so it looks better now. So let's go to the tablet. So it it has a microphone microphone spot over here. No speaker grid. It's like a traditional cell bar phone. It has a speaker like as a. So we have a two volume dropper button over here and a power button over here on the right side of the tablet. And this tablet can hold the two SIM and it has a 4G function and it has a 3.5 mm audio input and it has a micro USB and that's it. And it has a two megapixel camera as well with a bad flash. And the camera is like what I do, you know, 1.2 megapixel and 2 megapixel at the back and 1.2 at the front. So don't expect much from the camera. And it has a 3000 mAh battery as mentioned by the manufacturer. But when I went to the few apps, then I got that it has only 2050, around 2050 mAh. I have like installed around 5 GB of games and apps altogether till now. And uh, this is an open camera app, a free camera app. You can download it free from the Google Play Store. And this is the perfect panelist. Place some melodies over here. So as you can see, this has a good good touch functionality. Alright. It has a good it, it has a good display till now. See? Let it start from here. We can see slight delay, slight delay, slight delay on the keyboard, right? Slight delay, I don't know whether you can hear it or not, but there is a slight delay while I press the keys. Press the but it's fast because it has 2 GB RAM and 8 GB internal storage, 2 SIM capacity and 2 camera for video calling. You can't use to take beautiful videos or photos while you are on tour, okay? Uh, this tablet is like good for home purposes. You can't take this anywhere because it has poor battery. Good display but poor battery till now. Till now I don't know how long it's gonna last. And what else? Let's play a YouTube video. And this is a So no bass, no bass, no, no bass on the So this is good for web browsing YouTube, YouTube videos and maybe or you can play a few games like Andy Cross or Subway Surfer, Temple Run, all these mini games but you can't play PUBG, you can play PUBG Lite PUBG Lite, yeah, you can play PUBG Lite, you can't play Free Fire I installed Free Fire on this one and I, it didn't work so you can't play Free Fire but you can play PUBG Lite and you can even play Hopeless Land so I highly recommend you, if you are looking for a tablet around 50 or 60 dollar, you can go for this tablet. Uh, it has poor battery life, that's the drawback of this tablet. But apart from that, it, it, it has a good response, you know, touch response, it has a good touch response. Because I, I didn't expect it to be this good when I bought it, when I look. You can play games which are under 1 GB. And because this has only 8 GB of internal storage, 
and this tablet has only 2 GB of RAM so you have to install your game and apps accordingly if you go on installing too many apps then your game is not going to run smooth, smoothly and you can use this tablet for calling as well because as I already told you that it, it has the capacity to do all two sims and the sim slot is behind this thing I don't want to open this now it is beside this thing uh, this thing comes out you have to pry you open pry it open from here from here here and uh, there is a one sim here one sim here and memory card slot is here so you can install 42 gb memory card in this one and get a full limitless feeling of using a tablet so that's it for now thanks guys for watching my video so if you like the video do not subscribe or do not like just love me forever thanks